When collecting a TMR sample, you will need to have the following supplies. Gloves and a safety vest for personal safety. A sample bag for submitting the sample to the lab. A scoop or a dust pan and a bucket to collect the feed. A clean tarp for mixing the feed. A handheld brush for fine cleaning and a permanent marker for labeling. Start at one end of the feed bunk. Collect 10 scoops of feed and place them in your bucket for a composite sample. Make sure the samples are evenly spaced throughout the length of the feed bunk. Prior to mixing the composite sample, ensure that you are in an area with minimal to no disruptive conditions such as high winds or rain. Once you have an ideal location, lay out the tarp wide enough to accommodate the sample size. Place the collected feed in the center of the tarp. Using your hands, continuously roll the feed from the bottom to the top until the mixing appears consistent throughout the sample. Carefully separate the mixed sample into halves, then quartered piles. If there is excess particles between the quarters, you can use a handheld brush to sweep the excess back into the respective pile. Use the scoop or brush to discard two diagonally opposing piles into the bucket. Clean away any excess using the brush. Compile the two remaining quarters and thoroughly mix the feed in the same manner as the initial composite sample. Then repeat the same procedures to quarter the sample while making sure to remove the same diagonally opposing piles as before. Before bagging the sample, make sure the plastic bag is labeled with the farm name, date, and pen name. Take the finalized sample and place it into the plastic bag while making sure to collect any remaining particles on the tarp. Use the handheld brush or dustpan if necessary. Finally, force out the excess air from the bag or vacuum seal it. Now your sample is ready to send to the lab. The discarded feed can be placed back into the feed bunk from which it was taken.